today we're gonna check out some Reign of the Seven Spellblades. Logo review. But before we do, if you enjoy the video, like, comment, maybe subscribe to the channel because most of you are not subscribed. We're trying to hit 50,000 by the end of the year, which is possible with your help. And you can find the full link as well as exclusives over on Patreon. Now, if you want more of my reactions to Reign of the Seven Spellblades, like I'm talking episode seven, eight, nine, I'm gonna need you all to get this video to 500 likes in the next, I guess, three weeks. If you get this video to 500 likes in the next three weeks, I'll, I'll upload another video with episodes seven, eight, and nine all in one. Aw, uh, the troll feels bad about trying to hurt her? You have no enemies, troll. There's always gonna be assholes. How does her being around a troll means she smells like a troll? How is that going further than maybe her being around a troll is because she's slow like a, like she's not smart like a troll. That's worse, right? The smell thing could be like very legitimate. You calling her dumb, I think is worse than calling her like stinky, like, cause she's like hanging around. Like she could legitimately have the smell of a, of a troll on her. Like what the fuck? I'm not gonna be mad. I have no enemies. Yes! Yes! Blow his ass up! I hope he's fucking dead. I hope he's fucking dead now. I hope he literally just fucking killed him. What's up, bitches? Y'all trying to fight? Show them what's up. Spellblade! I have my one, two. I'm ready to battle these fools. I'm ready. Oh damn, they got they got in trouble. Yikes. <laughs> Why are you apologizing? They made the choice to fuck these stupid No 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 no. It's not her fault. It's not her fault. It's the other people's fault. Cause they're not gonna let that shit slide. Why the fuck would anybody let that shit slide? You gotta have out of Joe out here saying forbidden spells, killing spells. I would use I would use killing spells on these motherfuckers. Ooh, ooh! Kill them. Nah, she's looking too happy for this, bro. She looks happy. She's like, yes, I'll kill them. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Know your place? I really don't like this motherfucker, bro. I really fucking hate this guy. Dude, you, first of all, you can't even defeat him in a fucking duel, you stupid bitch. You literally can't do it. You're incapable. You're fucking trash. He's such an asshole, because you know the reason he's doing this, right? It's literally just because our girl doesn't want monsters to die. Am I wrong? Yes! Yes, what's she doing? Let's go, no, no, let's go. Yeah, throw your bottles, man, who cares, bro? Throw your fucking bottles. Oh, oh, hell no, dude. That one actually like hit her like legit, bro. I would be, I would, I'm gonna tell you right now, bro. Hey, she's talking about how like making people that don't want to fight fight is like really weak. Somebody just threw a bottle at her. That sounds like a fight. Time to kill him. You throw a bottle at her, maybe she throws a knife into your throat. I don't know, who knows? I have enemies. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I have enemies. Let's go! Let's go! Yes! Let's go! Yes, dude! Let's go, Peak! This is great, guys! I love this shit! Let's go! This shit's great. Hey, keep it up, bro! Keep it up! Bam! Let's go! Bam! Bam! Yeah, dude, you all wanted to play around. You're like, oh, let's attack the monsters. Let's do the... Yeah, now you get what's coming to you, so get fucked. That's all on you. Dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're... Well, you guys are... You guys are... Well, he he should be dead, too, but you guys are cool. Well, look at this. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's got a ten pack. This monster's got a fucking ten pack, bro. God. What the fuck? I can't even get six? It's got ten? Dead, dead. 
Bro, this is that 80%, 20% shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 20% of students die, by the way. This is that. This is that 80-20 right here. <laughs> this is it. An yet another way how, s how kids can be get fucking killed. They want to they they wanna play with matches, and then they don't realize that they're in a room full of flammable gas. Get him. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, he's next on your list. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yet. Yeah. Don't, don't just yell at him. Get his ass. Oh. Damn, dude, he is... Fuck. Oliver, you need to pull out a spell blade. Hello? Oh my God. You little bitch. I fucking hate this guy. Okay, cool. Good, 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 good. I think they work much better. Oh my god, I don't like this. Andrews! Oh! Redemption! Redemption! I mean, he's still an asshole, but hey, you know what? If he lives, I'm cool with it. Demon Slayer? Yeah. Okay. All right. That was kind of sick. Bro, this shit is gruesome. There's some wild shit. Oh, my God. Somebody fix her up. It's dick. Overall, man, that was a pretty good episode. Are all the trolls friends with her? They're homies. They're gonna start dapping each other up. What the fuck did they do? What the fuck did they do in that class? A real scary school. Yeah, dude, 20% of the people die here, bro. Bro, fuck all of you. Everybody, all of you. Okay, listen. Nanao likes him, right? Can we all agree Nanao likes him? What's what's the monster girl's name? That's Katie, right? Does she like Oliver? Yes? Okay. And then she just tried to kiss him, right? Did, did she just try to kiss him? No? No, she didn't try to kiss him. She didn't try to kiss him? Chat, you wanna you wanna stand by that? That's a harem. Even if it's not, okay? I'll say, I'll I, I'll concede, maybe she doesn't like him. But the people that got mad at me, cause I made a joke, in the, we see a guy walking, episode one, motherfuckers just walking. Oliver's walking there, a bunch of girls walk by, I'm like, oh, it's gonna be a harem. His first waifu. She's joining the harem. That's gonna be his best friend. Look at their hair colors, obviously, we know. He's a friend, oh, that's a Gyaru? Like, oh, she's definitely in the harem. <laughs> I just make it off joke. They are harem baiting right now. Two girls like him, a third girl tries to kiss him. That's a harem. It's no longer a love triangle. It turns into a fucking square. It means it's a harem, okay? So for all the bullshit everybody wanted to get mad at me about, you're wrong. I'm right. Just wait till Pete and Guy try to kiss him too. Harem. What did I say, dude? Fucking uh, the teachers, little shark tooth. She about to come through, give him a little nibble on the ear. Oh, it's not a harem though. She was just saying, congratulations, you got an A on the test. Mm. It's fair. You can make that statement, bro. If I kiss the homies and they say, bro, you're in the harem, I guess I am. I'm sorry I can't do more because we're in the cafeteria right now and I can't go further than just a kiss. That's what she's saying. Chat, that's what, she, <laughs> that's what she's saying, chat. I'm kidding. All right, we can move on. We turned the love triangle into a harem. No, no, that's what's happened. Yeah. The more the merrier. That's what she's saying, right? The more the merrier. Katie, get in there. Pete, get in there. It's your turn. Hey, bro, Riz. Then now got the Riz though. She's like, now it's your turn. 
I, I see her, bro. I see her, dude. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait, Memphis. She's gonna crawl under the table and take care of the seventh spell plate. <laughs> bro, I'm done, bro. Hey. He about to kiss her on the lips. Them succulent lips. Juicy, he about to. Something's gonna interrupt it. That's his sister? Yeah, made a lot of friends. He was about to make more than friends just now. He just said Nason. Cousin? Bro, what in the Alabama, bro? Y'all, listen, if they don't if they don't clarify right now, and he's like, no, but it's okay. All right, th this is how we greet each other. It's good. All right, no problem. But isn't he British? He's not Italian. Damn, no kiss for her. Wash her eyes with olive oil. Maybe he is Italian. Wait, what the fuck is this? Bro, this man just jumped on a live grenade. Oh, shut the fuck up, bitch. Hey, beat his ass real quick. Yeah, Pete's always fucking up, dude. Always, I knew he would. It feels so weird that they're all saying Mr. Right? I feel like it's supposed to be San. Horn San. Andrew San. It just feels weird. But also, I kind of like it. Respect. A mayor of United Kingdom. He's teaching her. Oh, he's speaking. That person is dangerous? Is she that person? That big person you call the troll. The troll's not a person. Or a troll, it's a person. Oh, never mind. Maybe it is just a troll. I don't remember episode one like that, but... Oh, shit. Did you? Why didn't you say nothing then? They already, like, kind of hinted that it was her when they showed her evilly smiling. What the fuck? Bro, she is crazy. Oh, shit. She's been doing this to a lot of fucking creatures. Oh, she has an evil eye. Our boy Oliver, he different. The eye of a gorgon, right? A gorgon? Is that what they're called? Snake Eye Milligan. Ooh. End of the episode, of course. Okay. Turn up, brother! Oh. I wonder how skill he seems really skilled, bro. That's crazy. She's like, you're a form formidable foe, but she's just like slapping away her attacks so lightly. She's just like, mm, 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 mm. You're a formidable foe. It, it doesn't really feel like it. I don't know, man. Look at it. She's literally one hand versus two hands. You're a formidable foe. That's just, I feel like that's just like even worse to say, man. That just feels really disrespectful. Oh yeah, you're really strong. Oh my God. You're like actually like putting up such a fight. Holy shit. What the fuck is this? Ooh. Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, wait. What the fuck is this? Ooh. But she gonna send it right back. She gonna throw it back? Or not. Okay, she kind of parried it, right? That's a parry? Bro, I thought she was about to... Foom and send it back. That would have been so hard, bro. But I mean, I'm, I'm fine with this. It would have just been cooler. Bro, homegirl is strong though. It had to go 2v1 just to stop it. 
Not quite. She got a little move. Yeah, she hasn't used her left hand this entire time, bro. What is she about to do? What is that? What the fuck, bro? She got an eye in her hand? First of all, that's nasty. And second of all, her hand-eye coordination must be crazy, bro. <laughs> her hand-eye coordination. But you just couldn't, you just couldn't go against her, man. <laughs> What's she about to do? And she's running for ages! Running in place! Evil Eye just turned this shit into a treadmill. The time that flows around it. Wait. What the fuck? Oh, shit! Oh, fuck! Oh, my God! She couldn't handle it. Unha unhand me. There's no, she wasn't holding her, so it doesn't really work. It's not really disarmed. She still got her hand. Oh. Yeah, I got nothing. I got nothing. Oh, well, we'll move on. You know, sometimes I nail it, sometimes I don't. The hand-eye coordination was crazy, right? <laughs> that's, that's a good one off top, but I got nothing for this. Bro, that's it? That's all it took? She loses her third eye, she passes out, she loses a hand, she's like she passes out, that's it? Yeah, yeah, I, my man's tripping. He's like, wait, what the fuck did you just do? I didn't even see it. She recognized the space, time, and distance that separated her and her foe as an obstacle and slew them. Wait, 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 wait. She cut space and time and distance. Is that what you're saying? You're telling me she cut through space, time, and distance? Bro, she literally fucking, uh, Fukushi. Fush, Fush, Fishuku, Fuk, Fukuchi. Yeah, 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 yeah. She literally the buddy from Bungo Stray Dogs. Holy shit. Oh, that was a spell blade. The seventh spell blade. <gasps> it's coming, guys. He's going to say the title. He's going to say the title. A seventh spell blade. Holy shit, bro. Holy shit. So she's the spell blade wielder, not our boy. I thought Oliver was gonna do it. What side you gonna kiss? The burn or the cut? So she saved him. Let's go. She saved him. That was the goal. Cutty flam. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hold on. This is hey, wait, this did turn into a love triangle. This is a real love triangle, bro. She she kissing up on everybody. I like this. Let's get a little coil hair in here. McFarlane in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. She disguised it. She's like, oh, no, nah, I didn't really want to kiss you, Oliver. I see, I kissed her too. I hope the homies do kiss after every battle. Let's go. Bro, she ain't even looking at her. <laughs> Yo, why is McFarlane literally not even looking at her right now, bro? She's like all the way over here. She's she is so bro. She got hit by the Milligan petrification eye, bro. That third eye got her fucking tripping right now, bro. She she's not even looking at her ass. Katie almost got turned into twenty percent, but she's still doing good. Oh. Oliver, Oliver words just touched, just touched Oliver's heart. Bro, why would you talk to him in this creepy ass? Bro, y'all are in this creepy canyon. What is this? I would not be talking to his ass here. This man's a ghetto, bro. He kind of a ghetto, a little bit. I'm just saying, there's a lot of stupidity in the human race, bro. There's a lot. Literally, literally, he's saying he wants to kill like 99% of people. Holy shit, this man is crazy. <laughs> I'm the 99%, <laughs> bro. Hey, me too. Have you seen any of my reactions, bro? How many things have I watched and I just don't even know what the fuck is going on? How many times have I been like, oh shit, this thing's gonna happen and I'm like, the furthest from close, like I'm not even close, dude. Uh, I would say that 99% of the time, I'm the 99% and then 1% of the time, I'm the 1%. You gotta catch me at the right moment. Literally in the same reaction, I can be the 1% and the 99%. Yeah, that, kinda, that was kinda rude. 
Okay, well, well, hold on. Bro, this man is narrowing it down. What is this? In the year 1525 of the greater calendar, on the eighth night of the fourth month, so April 8th, 1525, at 4.03 a.m. Bro, he just said, where were you on January? What what day is it? January 17th? What, what is the day that they stormed the Capitol? <laughs> January 6th, right? Yeah, he just said, I don't want to repeat it. Fuck it. I don't know, man. But that's wild, though. Hold on. Okay, no, no joke. Let's be real. What happened on that day? Oh, oh, he ain't playing either. Bro, my guy's gonna pop off and slay him, bro. He about to be like seventh spell blade. Oh, oh, oh shit. Guys, he can improve on any spell he's seen. My guy's about to hit him with the seventh spell blade. Oh, wait, he knows. He said, he said, I'm surprised anyone, uh, relatives of the woman still live. For seven years, he's hated this motherfucker. That's wild, bro. Bro, you about to get clapped up, Grenville? Ooh. Bro, what the fuck is he doing right now? What is he doing? What the fuck? Bro, he is like, um... What's the thing when you come out of your body and you're watching shit happen unfold in front of you? Projecting? No, he's, um, Ultra Instinct? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, Astral Projection, bro. What is this? And seeing the future, he about to hit him with the Fukichi for real. Bro, this man just activated the, the fucking, um, bro, the... Dormammu, I've come to bargain. He's just hitting him with that shit right now. He's seeing all the possibilities. There's only one possibility of defeating Thanos, and he's finding it right now. Oh! Oh! Shit! He just hit him with the Nanao! Holy shit, bro. Oh, wait, he kind of got hit still. Oh, he does have a spell blade! Son. That's right. I'm her son. And he about to hit him with the Havada Kalala. Oh, no, I don't know the pain spell. I don't know that one. The 128 forms of pain you inflicted on my mother that night. Oh, hell no, bro. Hey, if he hits your mom with 128, better hit him with 256. You know what I'm saying? 512, 1024, 2048, 4096. Holy shit! Next one! Hit him with the next one, bro! Good. Oh, bro, I, hey, hey, I fuck with this guy, bro. I fuck with this guy. This guy is cool, bro. I like this dude. I love Oliver, bro. This is my type of character. How often am I just, am I just, I need that shit. I need it. I want, I want, I want all the vengeance. Give me the fucking vengeance. Bro, we needed Oliver in, in my happy marriage. That's what we needed. Bro, hit higher with this shit, you know what I'm saying? Nah, don't talk about my mama. Yes! Oh, I love this. I like this. I fuck with this. I fuck with this. Oh, that was his mama? That's his mama? Bro, was he? Yo, wait, hold on. When he saw Nanao getting naked, didn't he think of this girl? I hope that's not his mama. That's a little weird, bro. Didn't he think of it? That's a little bit weird, bro. I don't know. Oh, shit. Who the fuck are these guys? Bro, I bet one of these, I, I bet. Bet money, bro. I'll pull out my credit card right now. I bet money. One of these is McFarlane's dad. I bet money. 
I bet money and he just being cool with her. But he got that deep hatred for her. Not her, but before her daddy. I, I bet money. It's either him or it's him. Oh, and this person did. Have we seen that? This person got some white hair, bro. And was he around? How did he know? Only the 57th. Damn, your weak ass couldn't even get halfway through it. Matter of fact, hit him with some healing and hit him with a couple more. Yes. Holy shit! Bro, I like it. This is my enemy. I like the shit. Hey, whoa, is that the girl that was in the hood that was always like following him around? I thought she just emerged from his fucking body. Like he cut her fucking, he cut the dude's head off and she just, <laughs> just fucking popped out of that bitch. I was like, what the fuck? Bro, this has been a wild ass episode, bro. I ain't gonna lie. This has been crazy, dude. This got some episode four vibes with how dope it's been. Bro, he's like a dark lord or some shit? Bro! Oh! Dude, are they all teachers? Oh shit! This motherfucker just wants to kill all the teachers! All the teachers! Hey yo, this shit is hard, bro. Hey yo, hey, y'all remember when I was a hey, bro? I can't believe I ever disrespected this anime, bro. Hey, I've been invested for, uh, but. I'm, bro, I put, I'm, hey, I'm putting money into this bitch, you know what I'm saying? I was invested before, you know, like, I was invested in this, like, I was invested with Dogecoin, you know? I put a hundred bucks in a Dogecoin, and I was like, alright, man, we'll see what happens. It's a hundred bucks, like, a hundred bucks is a lot of money, but it's like, I'm not gonna put everything into it. I'm putting my life savings into this bitch now, you know what I'm saying? Like, this shit is crazy. Holy fuck. That's dope. He's gotta kill all the teachers. I really, bro, I low-key thought that they, that, uh, hey, by the end of it, not gonna lie, we might find out that maybe the one that was really pulling the strings was McFarland's daddy. We don't know yet. We don't know yet. I don't know. I'm just saying I could be right. Right now it's looking like I'm wrong. <laughs> it's kind of looking like I'm wrong. But um, that was wild. That was wild, bro. That shit was crazy. This was a dope ass episode. Our boy has become the eminence in shadow. Legit, he has become the eminence in shadow. All right, so we start off the episode. Whatever, man. It's really cool seeing how our girl now accesses the seventh spell blade. That shit's hard, okay? The fight, whatever. They kill the Medusa and stuff. They chop off her little fucking hand-eye coordination. Whatever. It's also really cool that Katie, like, through it all, still gonna be kind. Still gonna be great. And it's wild to go to see us go from that, where he's, like, crying because she isn't losing that kindness, that whatever, that made her who she was. Because he's protecting that. To go from that to this i want to slay all the teachers in this school type shit bro that's wild all right so that was sick that he challenges the teacher he finds i don't know what ability that is but he literally locates the path the one in a million path that will defeat him chop off the hand hits him with the same the now shit and it's a spell blade so i guess he, is that what he did too did he also cut through time space and distance or was it a different spell blade? Cause like I think he got a spell. That was a he. It was it was pretty obvious that he used a spell blade. That's what he said. I thought that spell blade died with her. It was a different one. Okay, okay. Then whatever it is, whatever it was, it was a spell blade, and it was cool. That was dope. He did his own spell blade. But it's really sick that now access to seventh one. That's hard. We got to see the people that killed the the lady, the lady that he's been kind of like whatever about. That's his mama. It's his mama. And again, I just want to really like real quick. I'm pretty sure if we go back to episode one towards the end when he's looking at Nanao bathing, he thought of his mama. It's like, damn, this naked girl kind of reminds me of my mom. 
a little weird, bro. I'm just saying, that's a little bit weird. Just a little bit, but whatever. We'll move on from it. It was sick. I'm, I'm, I cannot wait to see him kill these motherfuckers, bro. This was a good ass episode. These were some banger episodes, episodes four through six. Listen, if you wanna check out my my review part of episode four and episode five, you gotta go on the Patreon. It's not included in this reaction on YouTube, okay? But um, this was fire. I liked it. What are your thoughts? You can let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. Until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.